And a new Maryland State Department of Education audit of the city schools found that more than 12,000 students, they got their failing grades changed to passing grades over four years. That audit found staffers at one school said they were pressured to inflate scores for students within two points of passing. Andy Rose Ramos has a closer look. Rick and Vic, this is a shocking report. One parent telling me they hope it isn't true because of how devastating this is for those thousands of students. But the majority of parents tell us that the main question they are asking is how is city schools going to prevent this from ever happening again? A new report claiming city schools is changing thousands of grades from failing to passing. It's really terrible. I can't even imagine that. This report from the Maryland State Department of Education comes after a three year investigation that all started after students complained about being passed even with their poor academic performance. Make sure the child is actually passing for real. <laughs> They're not just go on and pass them because it's not good for them in the future. While trying to investigate, auditors said school staff didn't want to speak out, fearing it would cost them their jobs. The report describes, quote, a culture of fear and a veil of secrecy affected the BCPS system and kept many from speaking freely about misconduct. Regrettably, these actions delayed the completion of this investigation and hindered the truth seeking process. I want to find out what's going on. This audit took a look at high schools from school years 2016 through 2020, finding Patterson High School had the highest number of changed grades. I hope it's not true. And maybe it's more to it than, you know, what meets the eye. City schools calling this report, quote, perplexing. In a statement, they say this grade changing incident happened three years ago. But for Mother Antoinette and Grandmother Miss Palmer, this isn't about failing grades, it's about our children's future. You gotta learn how to count money, reading. They need to go to school. Our children need a good education. So they can get uh, good jobs and all that, and so much going on in the streets and stuff with our kids now. And City School says they have conducted a massive overhaul of their grading system to, quote, ensure grading is fair, equitable, and accurately reflects students' achievements. I'm Annie Rose Ramos, reporting for WJZ.